Hi folks. Alternator stator test out. The completely only true way of doing so. And I want to make a quick video with this. I made a video prior to this with a little deeper explanation. But I want to get to the bottom line. You can see I have two stators. In one of them I have the ends removed. These ends here from the phases. I have them removed and I individualized the wires. This is the only true way of doing it folks. Bottom line is, is that you have coils of windings of wrapped copper and what you don't want to come up with is that you want to isolate individual wraps, windings, individual little coils. So you want to individualize them and you do not want to hear any kind of you want them to be isolated completely separated away from each other this way you know for sure whether you have a short or you don't have a short you cannot test it when they're all tied together like this it does not give you a test out result the only way you can do it is by isolating each winding and testing it from that point either with a test light um, a multimeter on the diodes or an ohms test you're basically just going to be making a circuit, a continuous circuit, and you want to make sure you get a reading on that circuit and only that circuit. If you're get, getting a reading on more than just that one circuit and it's getting a reading on another circuit along with it, then you have a short. That means inside this somewhere, there's two wires that are touching each other that have bare spots. Whether it's due to shellac meltdown, corrosion, whatever the results may be, overheating, and for therefore, if you come across that moment, that means the stator is, is no good. It either has to be rebuilt or recycled, basically. It's just no good. So that's the only true way of doing so. Um, you can do the research online. You're not going to find very many videos explaining a whole lot about stators. They, they, they show results on having it hooked up in the alternator, spinning the alternator and testing the creation of power being developed within the stator but as far as I'm concerned that's still not a good accurate test they may be producing something but they may not be producing what they're supposed to be producing and when they're producing at a free spin and not under load they're also going to be showing different differences which is just not a good test as far as I'm concerned the best test as far as I'm concerned is to test out all these windings that are wound individually and you have to remove them little clips in order to do so to test it out properly without doing that you're really not going to have a proper test and it's really not going to indicate to you whether it's good or not it'll leave you falsely thinking or unsure unsurably knowing whether it's good or not but once you make this approach by going this far into it it's going to create assurance that it's good or not good and that's what you want that's what you're looking for in the stator if you're testing it out you want to know if it's good or if it's not good I mean the rest of it just don't matter it's whether it's good or not good and you don't want any part of this shorting itself out whether it's with the body which is the steel part or whether it's within the wire the wiring itself you want everything to be isolated away from each other. That's the way it needs to be to work how it needs to work. And if you have any kind of short, it's not going to work the way it's supposed to work or it needs to work. And that's going to create a problem within the alternator or within an electric motor because everything has a stator to it. Electric motors have a stators to them. Um, everything, windmills have stators to them. Generators have stators to them. Anyhow, folks, quick little video. Um, I hope this little short bottom line video gave those that uh, do it yourself for type people a better explanation that they, they had beforehand. Thank you for watching. And for those that have subscribed, thank you very much. And for those that have not, please do so.